Hello mga ka good vibes! Welcome to our channel! So today we're at NASA Kennedy Space Center, Florida! So we went here 3 months before the pandemic. So these are the stuff we can be doing today. So we're at the Rocket Garden. It went to it went to space in January 31. Ah. Hey. You know what's in there? You know what made them fly? Oh, liquid oxygen and high This is Saturn B1 rocket. So look at the engine, it's so huge. So here's the better view of the SA-209 or the Saturn B1. This is a Saturn V F1 engine. This is the control room for the launching of Apollo 8. launch of Apollo 8. Right here, we are actually happy. Nose to nose with Space Shuttle Atlantis. In front of you is the Atlantis NASA's fourth space flown shuttle. Just as she appeared when she landed on her last mission, STS-135. Atlantis was in service for 28 years and flew 33 missions. Every time she launched as a rocket, flew as a spacecraft, and landed as a glider. That can leave a space shuttle a little worn looking but every smudge, every mark, and every stain tells a story. So this is the Space Shuttle Atlantis external tank that holds fuel for the main engines and the two solid rocket booster which provide most of the shuttle's lift during the first two minutes of the flight. The Space Shuttle consists of three major components, the orbiter which houses a crew, a large external tank, and the two solid rocket booster. This is the Astronaut Hall of Fame. It honors American astronauts and it has the world's largest collection of their personal memorabilia. This is the statue of Alan Shepard, the first American in space and the fifth person to walk on the moon.
I don't know if this is the exact one, but they say that they had a moon rovers here that was made from spare parts of other moon rovers because we've never brought back one from the moon. We're in the treasures gallery. This is Apollo 14 capsule. It has been in space and returned home. Oh my god, look at the damage and stuff at the bottom. That is pretty cool, right? They also have the traditional playground with digital interactives and artistic components that educate and entertain young explorers like my kids. So this is their food court and they have a store here where you can shop for souvenirs.